Yeah, fuck off. Jim. Jim, get out. Jim, get out, man. Get out. Are you laughing up there, bro? What are you doing? I've not got you any presents. What are you doing? Nothing. I heard sellotape. You're just playing with a sellotape. <laughs> Can I see what you've got? There's nothing in here for you. Why? Because. You're not getting in. Not yet. <laughs> 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 Juno, go away. Oh, Here's Juno's good. presents. They're downstairs. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the vlog. Uh, we're back. It's exciting vlogging again. We had a couple of weeks off the vlog. We just felt like we needed that. I talked about it on Instagram a wee bit. I can still hear sellotape, Drogba. I can still hear sellotape. We just needed a couple of weeks. There was stuff that needed done that we couldn't vlog or we didn't want to vlog. Ma, <laughs> I feel like I don't want to bore you anymore. I've got a bit of a funny shoulder, right? But I'm getting it sorted. Every day I was, I was sore. And to get me through that day, I would just think to myself, I'll, I'm sure I'll feel better tomorrow. And then I'd have a terrible night's sleep and then it wouldn't have got any better because I wasn't doing anything to fix it. But I have made steps to fix it. So I'm quite excited about it, actually. Quite a lot of people got some bad news about Christmas. They can't spend it with their families, especially those uh, in London. You know, it's kind of weird. We all were in lockdown and then we got told that we'd have five days off to have Christmas and then that's got taken back. Us in Scotland... <laughs> oh! Mainland Scotland's going into lockdown and mainland Scotland's pretty much like the whole of Scotland apart from like the island. One minute past midnight on Boxing Day, that's us in lockdown. So do you know what that way? It's just a bit of a funny time. I'm not going to talk about it too much. Um, I do think it's important that we talk about how we're feeling. I feel like I haven't really done that and I think that's because I don't want to give any, oh, I don't want to moan but really I haven't been a bit moaning just now because it's shit. Anyway, it is Monday, no it's not, it's Tuesday today. I wrapped some presents this morning. I've mostly finished work, I've got a couple of things to do. I've just kind of got to be on call in case anyone needs me. But I finished my last sponsorship of the year which is really exciting. Charlotte Tilbury, it was great. Anyway, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go and finish the last of my wrapping and I'm probably going to have a nap. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> I told you your present doesn't come and come after Christmas. You said it was okay. Jack, Did Jack. Did you not say this? Jack just came Are down. These <laughs> Are these not the words that no. you said? It wasn't coming till after Christmas. You just came down the stairs with a, a lush box. <laughs> yeah, it's for my mum. No, it's not. Yeah, it's for my mum. It's for your mum. What? Yes. That's why I'm just now back. Stop sniffing. <laughs> Dad just came down the stairs with a cardboard box that just had lush written all over it. <laughs> Good morning. It is Christmas Eve's Eve today. Very exciting. Um, I thought that I would show you how I do my waves on my short hair. I did it the other day. It's like similar to, to a video I've done before, but anyway, let's just show you. So this is my hair at the moment. It's pretty short. I'm excited. I think I'm going to have to go back long again. I miss my long hair a little bit. Uh, and then my fringe, which I'm growing out, I've decided. Even just so it's like a bit longer. I thought I would show you how I do this because it's super quick and easy. I don't do anything underneath my hair because when I curl underneath here and this bit, it just goes really, really big. So I just focus on the top and I get a little bit. I've just straightened my hair, but GHD Platinum Plus and I do a little spinneroo right to the end. Boom. A perfect wave. I'm so excited that I know how to do it. I just do it all in the same direction and I basically do it until the hole in my head looks like it's been waved but realistically, like I'm just grabbing bits, you know, but realistically underneath my hair is not being touched. I'm kind of holding my GHD like parallel uh, and then see for my little fringe, I just curl it out the way and see what it does. It goes into my hair so it's actually, it, it doesn't look short anymore if you know what I mean. So it's gonna look pretty nuts until I'm done. Go around, grabbing a bit, giving it a curl. So anywhere where you can properly see straight bits, just grab it, give it a curl. And I washed my hair yesterday and I actually just run my fingers through it straight away. Look at that, how good's that? Um, so I washed my hair yesterday, let it dry overnight for no reason really, I just was being lazy. And then see when I do this, the first day it will look quite done, but then I'll just leave it. 
for the rest of the week. I might, this might even last me till Christmas. It's really good. Neat way to style your hair. Yesterday I ended up finishing off some work, which is great. Uh, so it's Christmas Eve's Eve and I don't think I've got too much to do today, which is really, really nice. I spoke a little bit about how me and Jack took a break from vlogging. Cogs are turning, my friends. Cogs are turning, wheels are moving. And it's almost like the calm before the storm, I think, at the moment for us. Which makes me really excited because I, I spoke again, I spoke about this in my Instagram stories, but I absolutely love vlogging. Through this whole year, we've, we've mostly vlogged nearly every week, I think. I think we took a couple of weeks at one point. Yeah, we just, we just properly, it felt like we ran out of steam. We ran out of steam, we ran out of stuff to do. I don't know if you guys are the same, but sometimes I just think, oh, I see if I just had a week where I didn't have to speak to anyone, and I didn't have to get ready, and I just had a week to like sort my stuff out, that would be the dream. So that's kind of what we did. If I'm being honest, I actually think that we'll end up doing that in January. So <laughs> we, we've moved our honeymoon a few times to Bali. It's, uh, we were always meant to go to Bali for our honeymoon. And we ended up having to change it again. Uh, I say change it, they just cancelled our flights and didn't say anything about rescheduling, so I'm gonna to have to phone and check. We were meant to go last March, and then we moved it to July, and then we moved it to January, and how funny, because we just thought, we were like, oh yeah, everything will definitely be fine by January. It's not. So, yeah, we've had to cancel it again, because Scotland's going into a proper, a proper, probably the most intense lockdown that we'll have had since the start of all this in March. We really can't do anything at all. And when we were planning our honeymoon, we always said that we would take the time off and we would maybe vlog for one week because we were going to go away for two weeks. We we're going to vlog for one week and do our usual stuff and take our fun pictures and everything. And then one week we were going to go completely off the grid, uh, a social media detox, if you will. The only work we were going to do was that one week of vlogging, which is really fun when we were traveling and I just love doing it and I love documenting things like that so I can go back and watch. And then we would have our week off. So we've cancelled the honeymoon twice before and both times we've just ended up working through when we were meant to take a break. So I don't think we're going to do that this time. I think we might actually make an effort to do our plan, work for one week and then have one week off. I don't know, I need to talk to Jack about it, see what he's thinking. Because sometimes it's like, oh, we may as well, we may as well just work. Last night I had so much fun. So there's a trend going around on Instagram at the moment. Show me a picture of... So you post the questions box and people ask you to post pictures of certain things. And I don't have that many pictures from when I was like a teenager. I really don't. I think I had a different Facebook account or something. Or like we had Bebo. I'm quite a, a clutter queen. I quite like like cleaning up my computer and making sure I don't have anything. So what I did was um, I think I just deleted all my old accounts, which therefore deleted all the pictures. So, but I did that and it was dead funny. There's a, a lot a lot of old photos of me from when I was younger. It was just really fun. It was good fun looking through it all. It made me really excited for when things get back to normal. It was a bit like, it was a bit melancholic. It was a bit sad as well. It's so strange seeing people hugging. Can you believe that we've got to a time where if you see someone hugging, like, I don't, <laughs> I don't know if you guys are the same, but I found myself watching TV and shows and films and stuff, and if they hug in the film, I'm like, oh God. Or if they walk through like a really busy area, I'm like, oh God, they're gonna get COVID. So this is how I do my hair. I hope that was helpful. And then do you know what I do at the end? I blast it with something. So this is the Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast. This is amazing. It's like a texture spray. And I would just do this. And it gives you proper like tussled hair and look you can't even tell that underneath all that is straight but i just think it makes it look nice and chunky oh my god look at me clean styled hair we're having christmas party food i i think this happens every year we buy loads of food and then we think we're going to eat it all on christmas day and that really doesn't happen no. So what we've done this year is we've got party food and then whenever we get hungry and we fancy a snack, we just make it and eat it. And it's already working out better. All I can hear is you chomping those crisps. I can't believe I've had french fries in so long. Are they like good? Over a year. Are they good? Is it over a year? I got salt and vinegar, McCoy's. I honestly think it's my favourite type of crisps and I completely forgot all about them. I'm glad that you found 
found it again for Christmas. What's the film called that we're watching? Falling Down. Falling Down. We're watching a wee... It's Christmas Eve's Eve and we're watching a little film on Netflix. We're going to have some party food. Having a little red wine. What's on the menu, sir? <gasps> Mozzarella dippers. No. No, halloumi. No, ham and cheese croquettes. Oh! Ham and cheese croquettes and Dutch spring rolls. So we got a fright and we, we ended up going and just buying quite like quite a lot of party foods. We've got ham and cheese croquettes. Look at this. Croquettes. Croquettes the game. Ham and cheese croquettes. What's that? Croquette. That's me. <laughs> yeah, well, don't put it in my cupboard. <laughs> And we've got some spring rolls as well. I'm really excited. I'm really excited about this. Hi guys, Merry Christmas Eve. <laughs> Merry Christmas Eve. Guess what? Is it presents tomorrow? Is it presents tomorrow? Yeah, good boy. Good. Oh, you just punched him in the face. It's okay. Oh, it's okay. It's so nice. It's that sunny, cold way. It's perfect. Are you ready for a Christmas Eve walk? Are you ready for a Christmas Eve? <laughs> a very sunny, cold Christmas Eve walk. Look at that sky. Remember and rotate your hands. Mush, use one hand with a leash, other hand in the pocket. How you doing, son? How you doing? I wish I had rollerblades around so that I could just do this. Not Take in this me. terrain. Yeah. Off-road rollerblades. <laughs> there's a nice horsey boy in there. I actually can't even explain how cold it is. So we're back where we were at the horses, you might remember, a little while ago. And I want to share a really good point. So we joked about having sugar cubes in our pocket for the horses. And I would like to say that that was a joke so we wouldn't ever feed an animal that wasn't ours. But people were making a really good point. You don't know what the horses diet to the requirements are. Yeah, don't feed horses when you're on a walk, basically. I think people thought we were being serious. So we'd come with our pockets filled with apples. We wouldn't. And uh, yeah, I said that I would say wherever we're back. So don't worry, I'm not feeding you. Hello, nice horse. Oh, what a handsome bear! He did a jump! He did a jump! He likes to ground and pound it. Do this one? Do this one? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> Slam it! Slam it! Go on! Slam it! Slam it! Slam it! Hello. Call me a big kid, right? But when I was wee, I always got a Christmas Eve present, right? I think quite a lot of people do this. A lot of people get like a Christmas Eve box, they get jammies, they get a new mug for hot chocolate or something. And I'm not seeing my mum and dad today. I'm seeing them tomorrow, but I'm not seeing them today. Uh, they just text, my dad just texts me saying, whenever you're ready, your Christmas Eve present is on top of the unit in the makeup room. I'm so excited because they got me a crystal. 
right? And I've actually wanted this crystal for ages. They got it from a, a place called Venus Rocks. Now, some of you ask me about crystals and stuff and where to get them. You need to be really careful about where you get your crystals and, and make sure that it's uh, sustainable and ethical, right? So Venus Rocks is a really, really great website. My mum loves it as well. And this smoky quartz, smoky Lemurian quartz from Brazil, and it's a variety of quartz that embodies the soft, loving energies of the angelic and cosmic realms. They can assist one in finding harmony within and to join with the divine energy. It assists one in opening to the energy of the soul. So, oh my God, cool. So it's like both. <gasps> so that's the Lemurian quartz part of it. And then the smoky quartz is a powerful grounding stone. Smoky quartz is also a powerful stone for the manifestation of one's dreams and inspirations. It enhances practicality and organization <laughs> and offers great protection from the negative energies in one's environment. This is the best. So I know that they've had that. I know that I knew they put something in my room, but I didn't know what it was. And it's just been sitting in my makeup room. But look at this. I've never seen a crystal like this before. So for size reference, this is my clear quartz. Right. Clear quartz is a really good starter crystal, by the way, if you're ever wondering. So that's the size of that. And this is my new crystal. Oh, how absolutely amazing is that? Oh my goodness. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Oh, I'm so excited. That's amazing. So that's the smoky quartz part and then that's the Lemurian quartz on the other side. So it's like a hybrid. It's beautiful. Oh, I'm excited. So today's Christmas Eve. I went and got my nails done. It's the last chance that I could get um, before we go into lockdown again. And I just really wanted nails done. I've got a few things coming up for work in early January that I kind of need to be looking good, feeling fresh. It also hugely improves my mood. I just feel like my best self when I've got my nails, but look how cool these are. So I've got my JLX tips. I've got a white set and we've got a black set with little crystals at the base. I've put my makeup on, just a nice light face today. Just because I quite, I quite like getting ready over the Christmas period, I enjoy sitting and watching a film and doing my makeup and then on Christmas day I actually always usually I wake up in my jammies and then you know once me and Jack have had our breakfast and they've given each other some, some presents then I get ready. I just really enjoy it. I think it's a really fun thing to do. I don't really get glam in the clothes, but I get glam in the face. A really gorgeous day today. So we went for a nice walk with the dogs. Feeling really good. Feeling good and positive, actually. This is my little desk, so there's my new guy. And look at all of these. Aren't they fun? Yeah, I like this little zone in my makeup room. And also, the makeup room's just got good vibes all around. We've got real plants. This Monstera is... The best monster I've ever seen in my life. He loves it there. And yeah, I just love it. I just love it. So we've got all the good vibes in here. All the good vibes. It's great. That was such a fun surprise. I feel like a child. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What? What's that? What's that? Is that a stocking? Is that a stocking? Who's this? This is that. This is that. Oh. When did you do that? I didn't do it. <laughs> Who did it? I don't know. Santa. Santa Claus. Look, watch this. Drunk bar, that's not until tomorrow. <laughs> Drunk bar, that's not until tomorrow. <laughs> don't get it until tomorrow. But even she's doing it. It's Christmas Eve, so you can't have these right Not until tomorrow. You know the rules. Dog, but this is your fifth Christmas. Okay. Do you know it's allowed? It's only her oh, second. Oh, no, no, no. Oi. Tell him to leave it. Dog, but leave it until tomorrow. Come on. No. No. Come on. Come on. No. I'm Hi. Hi. Get back. Dog, but come Drogba. on. You can't have it yet. Patience this is, is a key. This is the whole thing. You have to leave it till tomorrow. Yeah. That's, that's my presence. That's for daddy. No, dropper. <laughs> oh no! No, 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 no! He burst it! He burst it! Dropper, put it back! Dropper, go and lie down. Go and lie down. She's like, she's like, I promise I didn't even try and open one. Look, I didn't even try. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I didn't even try and open one. You have to wait. Good girl. I know. I know you're good.
you make of the table? Would you eat off of it? Do you approve? Yeah! Good table, huh? What? I think that's it. I think we leave it super chic this year. Really minimal look. We'll do a test. Does so, it on be lunch test? Yeah. Okay, Just to make it. sure. Sexy, sexy, sexy. Oh my god, no, mum and dad are coming. A little bit of luxury, a little bit of sartred on. Oh my god, don't you want to just sit and eat and drink? Yep, you get a big thumbs up from me and a big pause up from the Oh. <laughs> Did you put the daily Lee on the cheese board? It was in the bowl. <laughs> Are you taking pictures with daily Lee in the middle? <laughs> it was in the bowl. So we're going to watch a film and enjoy this and it's going to be great. Merry Christmas Eve, Drogba. Do you just want to go to bed so you can wake up in the morning and get your present? Is that what you want to do? <laughs> Merry Christmas. Christmas breakfast. Merry yeah. Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Drogba, do you know Merry God. Are you getting your Christmas breakfast? Where are you going? Menu. Are you ready to go and get some presents already? No, you need to come and eat your breakfast. Christmas spectacular. Drogba, come and get your Christmas spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Christmas spectacular, look at oh, this. Oh, do you know, are you so excited about Christmas? Look at this, Drogba. Look at that wee tail going. Jack makes French toast and bacon twice a year on my birthday and on Christmas. Why is the bread just on the counter? It's not okay. That's where it goes. No, it doesn't. Check it out. I've cleaned the counter. No, you've not. I've cleaned the counter. I've no, after. Not. Sanitized. It's sanitized. And people laugh at us because this is how we mix eggs. We put them in a tenant's pint glass and then use a fork. That's how it's done. I'm excited. This one. Oh, very good. You're so excited. Job, are you excited? <laughs> you know, probably can't remember last year's Christmas. She'll just be wondering what that big smell of bacon is and why we're up so early. Job, are you excited? Are you so excited? Do you know what day it is today? Is it, is it Christmas? That's where all the nice food will be. <laughs> Yum. Did I tell you about how do you know we sleep next to you last night? No. Did I? Did I not? No. Oh, up at her head? Yeah. I'll show you. <laughs> I'm trying to break this up. So there's me. <laughs> oh, no. That's how I woke up this morning. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Jack. Merry Christmas, dogs. Drop by and do it. Oh, Jack woke me up at the crack of dawn. At the crack of dawn. He was up at six and I was like, go to sleep. And then he ended up managing to wake me up at 20 to 8. I mean, we save that energy for when we have kids and they're up at five in the morning. We're in the living room, we just had a lovely breakfast. What time is it? It must be still early. Yeah, 20 to 9. Let's see this. Do you know what this is? The famous opening titles of The Simpsons. Ever since I was really young, I used to get so excited about Christmas morning and watching The Simpsons because it was always on Sky One. There would be so many episodes. Right, I, I think... I oh, know! <laughs> it's been 40 hours of torture for you, hasn't it? I oh, know, look, I cannot wait. Where's your little sister? Do you know? Come on, present time. Was it time to open presents? Can you get that? Good. Good boy. <laughs> oh, oh. What have you got? Oh, get it open. Get on what? the edge, you know. Hey, Drop, you want this one? Drop, no. look, this one's a better one. Oh, take that one, you can get your... Good boy. You can get that ring in your gum. Yeah, you take that one. Do you know? Here. You can have this little one. There you go. <laughs> Up there and sits down. You don't get it. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at Look at that. Look at Look at that. 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 Look at Look at Look at that. 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 Look at
<laughs> She's so excited. What's that? Aww. Does it squeak? <laughs> oh, <what's that? laughs> the fullest belly of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, right, so um, I got properly ready and we had dinner and it was great. We had such a nice day. And then after dinner, I'm not well. I've, I've not overeaten like this in a really long time. And I keep on just thinking it's going to go away. Like I've even, look, this is what I've got for my drink. A big glass of water to try and help me feel better. I've started to lose my voice. It's been really a long time since I've been talking loud, but I was copying that TikTok. There's this hilarious TikTok and it's this girl that's kid known to be Lord Voldemort. Harry Potter is dead! <laughs> ah! 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 And I, I did that so much today that my voice started to go because Jack got me Harry Potter top trumps and I was doing that. <laughs> my voice is going. Have you had a nice Christmas? Yeah, it's been amazing. Have you had a nice day? It's been a great one. It's been really nice and low key, and I hope everyone else managed to have a nice time. We're just about to watch Interstellar on the couch and bring me my glass of water. Do you know what else I've got though? Fruit salads. And yeah, we just drank nice wine. It was just really good, wasn't it? Really good. I'm really looking. Do you know? I'm really looking forward to um, this year. And usually, I don't. I don't really think about it. But I'm really looking forward to the days in between now and New Year because I think it's just going to be a really nice, quiet, chilled week. And I'm just so looking forward to it. It's going to be great. But yeah, we're going to enjoy the last of our Christmas day. It's nine o'clock now. Hey, Chrysler. It do be beautiful out here, but it's not more beautifuler than you. Slam it! Slam it! Slam it! You're putting them off. Slam it! Stop. Are you excited for? Oh my god! Shh. <laughs> what? What's up? You're eating all the Christmas food. It's crisp. <laughs> Was that a good dream? Okay. I was just wrapping the dog presents. I think they can hear me now. <laughs> Stay back. Got nothing to see in there. Nothing to see. <laughs> so I, I like to like organize my, my computer. Oh my God, I've just messed that one up. We're having little cheers of glass, glass wine. <laughs> I'm gonna use the camera. Oh! <laughs> <laughs>